Hi everyone, so this is going to be a quick video about adding the start animation screen. Um, so it's going to play an animation video before you see the live view here. Uh, so similar to the way the mirror booth event is set up, uh, we'll do the same thing, uh, but still keep the live view. So we're going to go to device control. And I've already put them in, but basically what you do is, uh, if I were to go to delete, um, and I'll just delete this one too. I'll delete. So what you're going to do is go to attract, go to add, video, browse, and find your screen animation. So I made this one in After Effects. Uh, I'll leave a link in the description to my website where I'll be uh, supplying animations on there uh, in the future, starting um, next year. <laughs> uh, so you got loop video, maintain, and playback. So you may, you want these to be checked. Um, press OK, OK, and during startup, we're going to choose the booth command to start the session but you can choose whichever other option that you want uh, press OK OK so now that we have these two set up uh, in the screen I kept everything pretty much default but I removed the, the buttons because when they touch the screen it's gonna start the session so we don't need the buttons uh, and I kept the copies there. So all I did was just enlarge the live view, uh, kept the copies, kept the text, and the countdown. So now, when you hit start booth, uh, I don't have any printers connected, so hit OK. Um, they see the animation that I made, and it'll loop uh, every 10 seconds. So then I will click to start. So now you can see a full screen, but uh, you can make this live view bigger by just going to fill entire screen when you're editing things. Um, so then it'll take all its pictures and the copies button will appear at the end as default. So there's the copies and then, then there's the text. So if I hit escape to exit out, Uh, so now we're back in settings and then of course you can go to text uh, at the bottom and review photo so that way they can see the picture at the end but this is a cool way that uh, instead of having a static uh, just a, a plain image as the background uh, you can have uh, something that's a little bit more animated and make it look a little bit more exciting uh, than just the, the live view all right, ho hopefully this is helpful, and definitely check out my website for animations that I'll be putting on there. All right, I'll see you guys in the next video.